MMAviking.com here with Nico Masaki. We're three days out from the big event here. Hey, Nico, we, we last saw you when we did a press conference here. It was probably a month and a half ago. Uh, how, how real does the event feel now, just taking a peek inside? It's real, for sure. Uh, what we can see, they're putting screens up. Uh, there's a lot of people. Uh, we're here, we're just days away and can't wait. <laughs> Do you like the fact this has been a bit of a build-up? I think we've seen you at Fries Husit down the street. We've seen you at Globin, and now we're in the Teletu Arena. Yeah, and the fun thing is you missed one. Uh, we had Hovet as well. Oh, yeah, you were so, at uh, Hovet? Yeah. Oh. yeah, there's a fun story to that. And, yeah, I'm glad to be part of this historic event that will take place on, on early Sunday morning. Yeah, and you're on a... I don't know about a historic run, but probably one of the most you know impressive runs for a Nordic fighter, and you have a chance here to go four and one in the UFC. Uh, what kind of fight is this for you at this point in your career? Every fight is always the most important one you have. Uh, this time around, it's the same thing. Uh, looking back, it's been an intense year. Uh, I like it that way. Uh, now it's just all about stacking up wins and building my own streak. Lots of the, the Swedes here uh, kind of went away for training camp. Lots of the guys disappeared from the gyms during the holidays. How, how did you uh, work around just Christmas and the holidays with the fight so short after? Yeah, well, holidays has been business as usual. Just that we've been able to or we've had to uh, adapt some of the times. Uh, but then again, if you look at the whole picture, those were just a few days. Um, and yeah, we stayed busy all throughout. We just spoke to uh, Albert Tumanov uh, before you came out, and he said that he had a feeling he was going to fight you. Uh, can you talk to us about what, what you knew about Albert when the fight was announced and you heard his name? Uh, not much, to be honest. I know we fought on the same show in Brazil. Uh, but then, at the moment, I didn't know much about him at all. What do you know about him now, and how do you see this matchup? He is an intense fighter, uh, tends to lead with his hands. Uh, with that said, no one is either a pure boxer or a pure wrestler. Today, we do everything, and I'm ready for that. What's it going to take to get the win on Saturday, probably closer to Sunday, uh, for you? Uh, keep him, keeping him guessing and sticking to what I do and, yeah, finding a way to win. As always before, when I've, I tend to find ways to win and that's also a strength of mine uh, and I'm sure I will uh, on Sunday morning as well. Well, good luck to you, uh, Nico, in front of this huge crowd on Saturday slash Sunday and good luck to you.